Life begins at 40, or so they say. And for those of us who have crossed that milestone, personal satisfaction starts to become a pretty significant aspect of our lives. So today, I wanna dive into why personal satisfaction is so important for us guys who are over 40. Because let's face it, being satisfied with the life that we're living has a lot to do with our relationships, our health and well-being, and just an overall fulfillment in the life that we're living. I'm gonna cover quite a bit of ground today, and I hope you'll stick around. So look, for a lot of us, when we were younger, our priorities were focused around our career and our families. Because as the provider, this had to be our priority. But I think once we reach our 40s, and even a little bit beyond that, a lot of men reach a point of self-reflection and self-diagnosis, and we then start to prioritize what it is that we want out of life. Now, some might call this a midlife crisis, but that's just an unfair definition because it's not a crisis. It's just a period in our lives when we evaluate where we've been and where we are right now and where we want to go next. We look at ourselves and what we've accomplished and what more we want out of life. And like I said, in most cases, we've spent the last 20 or 30 years grinding with our heads down, providing for our families. And when we finally lift our heads and take a look around, a lot of us realize that the clock is now ticking. And now it's our turn to just do the damn thing while we still can. Now, but it is also critical to remember that personal satisfaction is all subjective, right? Because what brings satisfaction and fulfillment to one person may not even resonate with somebody else. So please, avoid comparing yourself to other people and just focus on your own unique journey. Embrace your individuality, your situation, and try to find satisfaction in your own accomplishments, no matter how big or small. So let's talk about aesthetics and self-confidence. And I talk about building self-esteem and self-confidence on this channel all the time, and that's for good reason, because I strongly believe that self-confidence and high self-worth provides you with opportunities that you just wouldn't otherwise have. And the truth is that your overall aesthetic and your actions either draw people to you or repels people away from you. And that's why I talk about improving your style and your grooming because look, not only does that help draw people to you, it helps you feel better about yourself, which in turn leads to more personal <laughs> satisfaction. I mean, listen, as a man over 40, you have a gift. You have the wisdom and life experience to make deliberate choices that bring you personal satisfaction. You've looked at yourself in the mirror your whole entire life, and you know when your personal aesthetic needs work. You are the first to know that maybe your hair is starting to get a little thinner, and you're the first to know that maybe you've gained a little bit of weight and let yourself go. You know this deep down whether you want to admit it to yourself or not, but now is the time to start making those deliberate choices to do something about it because you also know that the sooner you start improving yourself physically and mentally, the sooner you get to enjoy, appreciate, and respect that guy in the mirror who's looking back at you. So let's chat about thinning hair for just a second and then we'll move on to some other aspects in just a minute. Now we all know that hair is considered an important aspect of physical appearance. And for many people, a full head of hair is associated with attractiveness, youthfulness, and for a lot of guys, self-confidence. And the sad fact is that hair loss or thinning hair can cause self-esteem and body image issues with some men. And that's why I'm excited to have iRestore sponsor today's video and to talk about the iRestore Pro. So this is low level laser therapy for hair loss. It uses both lasers and LEDs and it's FDA cleared. It's the only device on the market that combines 282 lasers and LEDs to provide the correct light output and power level to stimulate hair follicles. And truth be told, I know a guy that's been using this exact device for about eight months now and he is completely sold on this product because it's working for him. Okay, think of low level light therapy as watering your plants. Hair is either in the process of growing, resting, or falling out. And the light energy acts like water and nutrients that gets absorbed right into your hair follicles to keep your hair in the growing phase. And like I mentioned, it's FDA cleared 
clinically proven technology and it's super non-invasive. And it's just 25 minutes every other day. You can use it just sitting on the couch watching TV or working at your desk or just hanging out reading a book somewhere. Seriously, this could not be any easier to use. And if you get the battery pack that sold separately, which I highly recommend that you get, you can have complete mobility when you're using it. And look, even for guys like me who still have a pretty decent amount of hair, I'm still smart enough to know that it won't always be like this. And it's already getting a little bit thin back here on my crown. So listen, if you're interested in checking this out, please do yourself a favor and visit our special link down below in the video description and also use our special discount code to get a limited time and exclusive savings off the Pro device. Now, this is gonna be a big discount, but you've gotta go through that link and use our code to see it. Like I said before, this could not be any easier to use. And even if you still have hair, consider this a way to help keep it growing. The link is down below, so definitely go check it out. Now let me talk about personal satisfaction in terms of life fulfillment. Once again, if you're a man over 40, you have had the opportunity to explore lots of different paths in your life. You've made many choices and you've racked up a lot of achievements along the way. But think about it. Without any personal satisfaction, your accomplishments and achievements might feel a little bit shallow or empty. So by actively seeking personal satisfaction from this point forward, you can ensure that your pursuits align with your passions and your values. Now I wanna chat about legacy for a second. And I've mentioned this before in a bunch of other videos, but at some point in about this stage of our lives, we realize that we've lived more time than what we have left. And that's not said to be depressing, it's said to be an opportunity because we all do it, right? We, we think about our legacy and the impact that we would like to leave behind. And at least for me, personal satisfaction is a motivator for me to help make positive differences in the lives of other people. Acts of kindness, mentorship, and philanthropy, that can all create a lasting impact on not only your close community, but also society. And I've always said this, but if I ever won some gigantic lottery, besides making sure that myself and the people that I care about were taken care of, I would spend the rest of my life giving it all away and I would enjoy every second of it. Another part of personal satisfaction is really embracing self-care. And I know, self-care is a big buzzword right now, but take care of your physical, take care of your mental, and take care of your emotional well-being. Prioritize taking part in activities that bring you joy and fulfillment. Whether it's your hobbies like tinkering in the garage or playing golf or even getting regular exercise. Living in a constant state of stress is not satisfying. Make it a priority to do things for yourself to give your mind a break from all the daily stress and give it what it really wants. Another area of personal satisfaction is within the connections that you make. Please surround yourself with positive and supportive people that encourage you and also share similar values and work on those relationships every chance you get. And I can tell you from personal experience, when I'm around my positive and supportive friends, it is incredibly satisfying and it makes me feel like I can do anything and they would always have my back. And it goes both ways. And just for the record, all of these are things that I'm working on right now in this stage of my life. And I hope that you'll join me. Nurture your positive relationships and let go of the people that are holding you back. Keep pursuing personal growth and embrace the things that bring you joy. And like I always say, it's never too late and you are never too old to make a change in your life or start something new. Thank you very much for watching. Live well, and I will see you in the next one.